Hello and welcome back to Cracker Corrections. Today's video is going to be an update on the uh, park and some of the new uh, pieces that we have in the park and kind of tell you what we're working on and what uh, the future holds for the park here. So uh, today I want to talk about um, some additions that we have to Main Street. We're going to talk about the train a little bit and we've got some happenings going on back in Fantasyland. So first off, let's talk about uh, the train. Um, here is the train. I've got a couple new um, cars on the train there. So we're gonna have a lot of uh, park goers in the train there. And we see it coming up and going over uh, in front of the uh, train station there. We've got it nice and um, uh, set up to go around the park. Let's take a look over here on this side. Um, as it comes uh, down the front there, it's gonna come around and it should be pretty nice sailing through here. And then it goes all the way down behind um, Tiana's Bayou Adventure there, which I am waiting for a tunnel piece that I'm gonna then adapt and uh, clean that up uh, at the opening there, as you see behind Tiana's Bayou Adventure there. So you can kind of see it goes all the way down the side here. Shouldn't have any obstruction there, but my problem is gonna be on the other side. I again have not left myself a lot of space for the track itself. So what I think I'm gonna do over here is on this movable table here, I'm going to build a, uh, a lip off of the side here, which uh, when I move the table should go between these two poles um, because I'll have the wall on this other side here and um, it won't obstruct uh, the amount of space that I have when I move the, the table out so I can get to Main Street there. So I'm gonna build something off the side of here and then it's gonna come down. And I need, I want it to go uh, through Tron there, but I'm not sure yet how I'm gonna manage that. I don't know if I'm lifting Tron and I'm gonna have the train is gonna come up here a little bit and go underneath uh, Tron. That's an idea. Um, I don't think that would be too bad to do that. And then as we come back here behind, it's actually, it's going to disappear a little bit. It's going to go down. I'm going to build something underneath, uh, the back here and it's going to go down behind everything. Um, and then back, uh, and then it will reconnect here behind Tana's Bayou Adventure, which I'm going to have to clean up some, this area over here, even though this is an area that gets seen a lot. I'm going to uh, put some more foliage there and that, but I want to get the train going first. Um, so this is what the, this is a little bit behind here, uh, what we're looking at. Um, and um, what, uh, the second thing I wanted to talk to you guys about today then was filler magic. So you can si kind of see here, I have got the building kind of built out there. So you guys can kind of see that. Um, the lighting's not great right now. And obviously I don't have the... Um, the, uh, the post to keep that up, but I built that uh, front entrance there in so I can, um, so I don't worry about it relying on the post when I build the post. So tell me what you think. I think it looks decent. Um, I think it looks pretty good. Uh, it's got a lot of coloration in there. I've still got to make the sign and then the, um, there's some um, spires coming off the top of that. And that, but I think it fits really good in there, right next to uh, Peter Pan's flight in uh, Fantasyland. There, so still have to do a lot of putting down of uh, tile um, on these base plates here. Same way in um, Liberty uh, Square area, and then some areas of uh, Tomorrowland as well, and Adventureland for that for the, for that most. So um, that's kind of what we're looking at there. Be a couple of views from this side here and so as i zoom in there you guys can see uh what i've done i think it turned out really good i'm pretty excited about it um i think it's gonna be a great addition to um fantasy land there so it just kind of rounds that out a little bit and you can kind of see how it's given that vibe a little more here uh than what we had uh before so that's kind of what we're looking at there. And another addition is I have added a, um, a building to Main Street there. As you can kind of see when you come around the ice cream parlor there and come down that building, uh, the, sec the third building in then is uh, a new addition. I'm gonna get around 
Uh, I'm going to get into that porthole there and kind of show you that because I'm also going to be getting um, another building on the other side of Casey's uh, corner there. So let me go into that uh, area and show you that. All right, and here we are in the uh, porthole here and we're looking at the uh, train station and right on down Main Street. And then as we come around the side here, you can see where we have placed that new building in there. And I think it fits great. Uh, with the architecture of that area, a couple of restaurants that are on the that area there, uh, next to the entrance to uh, Tomorrowland there. So um, that's shaping up, and like I said, I'm going to be uh, putting another building right here, and um, Olaf won't be there, uh, but um, I'll be putting uh, a new uh, building there to uh, round this out up here. And I think it will balance then the sides. So it's the size of the building is gonna be about that same size and it'll end, um, it'll broaden this area of uh, Main Street at the end here. And I think it'll look really good. And on this side, it'll be transitioning actually to the first aid area, which is back through there. It's in between that building and um, the Crystal Palace there. So that's kind of like, um, rounding off Main Street there. Uh, I'll be lighting those buildings up as well. Uh, but you guys can see a little more detail of that building there. Right there. And I still have uh, Tinkerbell's line coming down from the top of the castle to that area as well. So uh, that's uh, that new building. And then as we look, you guys can see in the fantasy land here, you can see the back of Filler Magic there. And that, like I said, is really going to clean up that area there. So got a lot to still complete with that. But as we look uh, into Adventureland now, we've got a lot of wiring going on here. Still got to do a lot of work over on this side. I've got to get um, uh, the uh, Country Bear Jamboree there and get that little passageway. I kind of started it with the tile work there and then fill in some of the mills plating there uh, to, uh, to come through to adventure land there so got a lot of the lighting up um, i'll be able to conceal all those wires as much as i can i know i don't do a great job of that but i really have not built it to conceal them as much a little better now than in the past but obviously um still still seeing some of the wires um so uh again somebody wanted me to show them a little bit about uh the jungle cruise a little more detail the jungle cruise so let's get down a little deeper there here is, um, before we get into that, here is the uh, Aladdin's uh, carpet ride there, the, car the magic carpet rides of Aladdin. And you can kind of see how we've done that. And then around over here, I am reaching now around the Swiss Family Robinson Treehouse. There's that Jeep. Uh, there's the back end of the uh, airplane. That airplane, remember the front half of that, it was in the Casablanca scene in the great movie ride for you guys, you movie buffs or ride buffs, attraction buffs out there. Um, here is the um, the elephant um, area and the backside of water there. And, uh, and some IPs, again, Star Wars, uh, the Endor race, we've got... Um, <clears throat> or the end or chase, I should say. And then we have um, some avatar and I've got to get that area lit up um, as well um, because I, that, that's not totally lit up. Some, some of the adventure lands lit up, but I'm going to light that up. Got to do a lot of work on um, uh, the Pirates of the Caribbean over there too. That's coming along, but I've got some, um, some other, um, you know, IPs that get stuck into that. Um, I like to do that. I like to put all the different IPs and some of the different things that I have into uh, the, the build. Um, still have to work on this wall here. So now that I've got that building placed there, it conceals that a little bit. But where I have that, um, the, 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 the table that rolls out there. So I've got to work on that right in that area. Um, and um, still have to work on this side here, concealing some of these uh, junctions and getting this sidewalk over so we can get behind the castle from this side. But as we look down here at uh, the Hall of Presidents, people were asking about that. And there that is, uh, back towards the uh, Haunted Mansion. And we've got to get a lot of tile work. We've got to get a lot of tile work on the... Um, uh, 
um, this water area around uh, Tom Sawyer's Island there, and then the entrance to the Big Thunder Mountain as well. So that's kind of what it looks like here. Here's another image of uh, Tiana's Bayou Adventure. And uh, I'm going to um, end the video here. If you guys, I really appreciate you guys following, like, and sharing. Hey, uh, shout us out out there. We're really trying to grow the channel so we can continue to do this stuff. Um, I'd like to uh, get as many people uh, eyes on the, the project as we can because we really uh, like uh, when people comment and just take a look and look at the nostalgia that we kind of emulate here in this uh, the park here. So until next time, guys, we will see you soon. Bye-bye now.